everyone, it has been here at the Cardano Summit 2022. We are in Lausanne with thousands of people joining us in the room and virtually at the Summit Lodge. It has been a phenomenal opportunity to come together, including our 50 community-led groups that are happening all across the world. We've had speakers on a whole host of topics that will help us ignite and build Cardano. Let's take a look at some of the highlights. We kicked off the day, of course, with Frederick Gregard, who took a moment to reflect on how important it is that the entire Cardano family are coming together. It's truly magnificent to come together after COVID and physically meet people. I'm hearing the same from the 50 locations around the world as well. This notion that humans communicate with real humans, where we normally you know, are behind the blockchains and behind the web, is, uh, is where real innovation is happening, but also where new alliances are forged and ideas are being broken, so it's, it's fantastic. Catherine Foster joined us in a phenomenal panel exploring how blockchain can help us achieve sustainability. Blockchain can help sustainability in a number of ways. First of all, because sustainability, the SDGs, are national goals and targets, it's largely voluntary, and measuring progress towards that is very cumbersome. And in, on top of that, solutions have been fragmented. And blockchain and emerging technology combined can help us largely to address the, that fragmented solution space. And we are just scratching the surface. So let's take a moment to catch up with a few of our speakers. I'm meeting a lot of old friends including the friends in Cardano Foundation, um, Input Output, and also some other projects that are creating product, products on top of Cardano. Uh, we're really connecting with the Cardano community here, and uh, we are talking a lot about Cardano, about Algorand, and it's great that uh, uh, the community gets to know Algorand better, and I get to know Cardano better. It has been a jam-packed day, and tomorrow will be even more full. Let's take a look at what we've got in store. And not forgetting, in Auditorium A, we've got big discussions on impact finance, the metaverse, and so much more. But before any of that, tonight is the night that everyone has been waiting for, our inaugural awards ceremony. It kicks off at 8 p.m., so I have to go get washed, get tidied up. And if you are joining us online, do not forget to tune in. It will be a phenomenal evening for everyone. I'll see you there.